It's a UFC featherweight division fight. I'm excited for this one. This is a kickboxer of the highest order. He has so many different kicks and punches in his arsenal and figures to try to keep this on the feet here tonight. The beautiful thing that he does is he throws that front push kick to create distance when a guy starts to get too close and wants to wrestle with him. He throws it, and the moment you're back at his range, he starts to blast high kick. He doesn't always intend on landing him, but he beats up your arm with high kick after high kick after high kick. And as you get desperate, you start to run into knees, and he does not need much space to land a knockout punch. This guy is one of the best strikers we've ever seen in the UFC. And if you don't find the striking range early against this guy, you could be in real trouble. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique, because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. All right, now let's get to the tail of the tape for this featherweight tilt. So more than 10 years apart, these two fighters, with some differences in height and a similar reach. All right, now for the particular, here's Bruce Buck. This is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC featherweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 139 pounds. Express! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce. The Dragon Lee! Okay, could take yourself at all time, will be my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your So here we go with the start of round one. I can tell how excited you are for this matchup. It seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but maybe not. This is a big time fight. It feels like a big moment for both of these guys' careers. Who is going to be able to implement their game plan the best in this matchup between these two big time athletes? Punch over the top. Perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Well, missed on that one. Kick to the body by Lee. Oh, huge block! Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Nice punch there by Lee. Big shots being landed on both sides here. I mean, he's cutting down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Comes in close, controls his opponent's posture, 
It lands just nasty up. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Nice sneaky head kick. Sound defensively blocks the shot. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Nice connection with a the punch there. It's hard to recall a time in the past that his boxing looked this sharp. He's never looked this good. Just over three minutes to go now. Punch coming is blocked. Straight right, he misses. Under three minutes, remain in round one. And they separate. It's such a fast leg kick. Checks that leg kick. Good punch. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. It might not be over now, but it's gonna be over very soon. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Ooh, head kick lands to hurt. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. Good job keeping that head off the center line. Slips to avoid the right hand. there to his opponent, and he lands it just after catching the leg. So clearly, he is starting to find his timing, not just offensively, but defensively as well. Very good read there. And they separate. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? And he landed the right hand there. Oh, yes, it is a lost art in mixed martial arts. Not just the jab, but the double jab. I mean, a beautiful double jab. That thing's throwing right from the chin, too. Real sneaky body kick. Oh, he lands, he lands, and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. He blocks the punch. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. We'll finish his fight. Oh, big left. Just unable to quite find that range. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Huge knee lands for the Tycoon. Five minutes in the books. Well, he certainly added to his highlight reel in that previous round, DC. A lot of effective kicks there to the body. And he did a great job of setting up those kicks. He's not throwing blind body kicks. He's not just throwing the kick. He's throwing it behind jabs. He's throwing it behind punches, making his opponent think high, and then blasting that kick right into his opponent's body. All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg packs so much power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going here in this He round. doesn't throw it full power, but even when he faints it, he draws out reactions from his opponents because they don't want to get hit with any more of those kicks. It's a sight to behold. Lands with the right hand. Big kick lands. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. Big lift. 
liver kick lands under the elbow. Over and over, he landed with big body kicks. Just misses with the straight right. Good punch land. Oh, and he caught the kick. Oh, man, head kick lands. Well, he's doing a nice job here blocking these shots. The chin is tough, the hands are high. Pretty good job defensively thus far. Great job defensively. He's seeing everything coming. Oh, nice job landing the knee there. He's got a lot of size for this division and put it to good use there. Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Oh, he got everything behind that kick. Oh, what a head kick. That's a good right hand. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Slips the punch nicely there. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are gonna take their toll as this fight goes on. Lee gets hit with a kick. That one appeared to land flush. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Just out of range with that right hand. Lee gets caught with that punch. Oh, combination lands. You wanna talk about putting strikes together. Beautiful execution. And every one of them are landing. It's overwhelming him with different attacks. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Powerful kick there. A lot of volume with the feet tonight for him. It's unbelievable to watch somebody make kicking the base of their fighting style. He has shown us that it's possible. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. And they set her. Nice job of hiding that head kick. Nice punch, Lynn. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Oh, tagging with that right hand. What a strike that was. What a strike that he is landing over and over again. His opponent will need to make some adjustments. Lee gets touched by that kick to the body. Oh, and he lands yet another strike to the body. Pinpoint placement right underneath the elbow. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Ooh, what a punch. Fourth we go. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Big knee there to the chest. Whoa! He's mixing up his target. He's throwing kicks. He's throwing punches. He's got him hurt here. Just missing on the high kick there. He gets caught with that punch. Whiffs on the right hand. Oh, a huge block there. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Lee. And a nice jab there, champ. The jab was a lost art in mixed martial arts. Guys have found it, and they are fighting behind it real well. Nice joke and good. There's a lot of blood. Can't go much longer with a cut like this. Need a All right, let's take a look back at some of the highlights from those previous five minutes, DC, and uh, no padding, no glove on that foot. No glove, no padding, and look at the hip action 
when he throws those kicks. He's not only kicking just for feel, he's really trying to damage his opponent. And as the fight goes longer, you will start to see it taking effect. All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next Ready? round. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kicks. He's throwing high kicks, leg kick, body kick. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. Going to the leg kick now, and it's there. Nice job by Lee. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the <laughs> whole platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found a set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. Liver kick. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. Ooh, what a punch. Very badly. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Lee's looking to pass out of the half guard here and get that side control, but he is denied by the opposition. Keeping busy here off of his back. Nice offense from the bottom. Close guard. Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. He continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Nice. Oh, oh, kick kick home, and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it was coming high, and now he's got hurt bad. He does everything so well, and he's so calm. He's so calm in the face of such a big spot. Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go take that minute, though. And just like that, the fight is over. Oh, my goodness. What a performance. Yeah, that was just a gorgeous shot to end the fight right there. I'm not even sure the opponent really saw it coming. So back to the drawing board for him. But for the winner, this is certainly exactly what he was looking for here tonight. All right, let's get you some replays now. Certainly a lot for our replay guys to work with in the truck. This was a clinic tonight in terms of mixed martial arts acumen in every realm of the game. A full-on display of all of his skills. He did everything in this championship winning performance. He used his wrestling. He used his elbows. He used his pace and pressure to really wear down his opponent so that he can get his hand raised. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Ian Levine's called a stop to this contest at 2 minutes, 21 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee! Oh, well, there he is after a huge knockout win tonight. You going to the after party or what? I mean, I'm heading over there right now, John. <laughs> I'm asking the producers, how soon can I get up? Because it's going to be a party over there. Not only because of the knockout, but that extra bonus check he's going to be carrying to the club tonight.